revolution is a product of social, cultural and economic disparities. Perpetuated by geopolitical reasons, the momentum of an agitation is considerably determined by the degree of people's involvement to the cause. The annexation policies, oppressive colonial rule and administrative vagaries of the British rulers and also their indifference to Indian cultural practices cause dissatisfaction among the people of India. In Odisha specifically, resistance to dominance being a natural phenomenon had its corresponding impact in the tribal region. They fought tooth and nail against the oppression and exploitation. The Kandhas are worshippers of nature. They revere the soil as a mother. They believe that everybody lives in the world by the mercy of the soil. They sacrifice a member of the tribe for mother soil and celebrate Maria every year. The British treated this system as superstition and antisocial, leading them to raid the tribal areas of Kalahandi and Pulbani under Major General Campbell. The Kandha's philosophy is that a human's physical body is created from the soil by God. So if anyone sacrifices a life for the uplift of someone else, so it will be a transformation. When the British captured Nagpur, Kalahandi went under their control and as per the institution of kings and zamindars of Kalahandi, they collected tax from the Kandhas. And their age-old tradition of Maria sacrifice was banned. The aggrieved Kandhas rose in the world against the foreign rulers under the leadership of Rindo Maji, who was born at Urladani in Kolahandi district in a tribal family. He organized movement against the British. Despite all efforts, it became difficult on the part of the British to nab the rebels. A.C. McNeil, who succeeded John Campbell as the Maria agent, arrested the Borigia Kanda leader Rindo Maji and his son Palaso Maji in 1853 and kept them in jail at Russell Konda without trial. The revolution grew much stronger among the Kandhas after Maji's arrest. In December 1855, during his annual tour of the Kalahandi state, the Maria agent paraded the prisoner Rindo Maji in chains from village to village. The Borikia of Kandhas, who could not stand this humiliation, hurled on their chief by the British agent. On the 10th of December 1855, they attacked the camp of Lieutenant Colonel McNeil. However, the attack was repulsed with some casualties on both sides. Two or three days later, the Kutia Kandhas joined the Borikia Kandhas and they together made the second attack on the agent's camp. It was due to the wisdom and help of Dinabandhu Patnai, the Tehsildar, that McNeil could escape to Russell Konda. On the 10th of December, 1855, the British hanged Rindo Maji. young man of immense moral courage, Rindo Maji, kindled the fire of a new hope among the tribals and planted the seeds of liberty and freedom. <laughs> 